Hello and welcome to another edition of Daily KHL Update. There's just one game to go over tonight, so I'll keep it short but informative. My name is Andrea Sachinka. Let's go! Red Hot Locomotive hosts Atlam for the only game of the day. First period, Ilya Kablukov gets on a breakaway, but Curtis Sanford says yet. Actually, he probably says no since he's Canadian. Early in the second now, Mikhail Gukov loses his balance. This could be costly. Pashkin to Petrov, and there you have it. one nothing Locomotive as Petrov scores his first of the season. A little late for that, but you get what you can get, and Loco certainly needed that goal. Just a few moments later, another breakaway for Atlant. This time it's Evgeny Artuhim, but Sanford stands tall on this one as well. Still 1-0 Locomotive. Third period now, Ilya Garokov cuts into the zone, dishes it over to Igor Musarov. He can do whatever he wants with it, and he puts it in the net. That's his second, and now it's 2-1 Locomotive. That's the kind of score they know how to defend well. Last minutes of the third, Yuha Pekka Hatai shoots from in tight. That must be a goal, but it isn't. Hatai is absolutely robbed by Sanford. He's putting on a clinic tonight. Nothing gets past him. And that's it. The horn goes off. Locomotive gets three points on home ice. Curtis Sanford gets his fifth shutout of the season with 36 saves. And Yevgeny Artukin ended up getting another game misconduct with just seconds left on the clock for checking to the head. I feel like I've heard this before. Probably even said it. And that's it for your daily KHL update. Busy days in the K come back this Friday. Another 12 game day with lots of great stuff on tap. It's gonna be fun. My name is Andrea Sachnika. See you guys tomorrow.